State Storm Team Forecast. Hey, it was a foggy start to the morning, widespread across the Susquehanna Valley, and I set the time lapse here up in Harrisburg from earlier this morning, starting at 5:40. It was a pretty foggy scene, and it pretty much stayed that way at least through the early morning hours. But that uh, May sun angle really helped burning things off, and now we're basically sitting without the fog. It's staying kind of hazy, and we are starting to see some of those bubbly type cumulus clouds popping up. A sign that their heat, humidity, and sunshine may bring some thunderstorms for us heading into the afternoon hours. Right now in Harrisburg, it's 76 degrees. That dew point into the mid 60s with a northwest wind. We're a little light right now, around three miles per hour, but it's been jumping up to around 10 to 15 miles per hour. It'll pretty much stay that way through the rest of today. So it will be a little breezy heading into. To this afternoon. Partly sunny skies here in your News 8 Storm Team forecast, but also a few thunderstorms cannot be ruled out. And uh, the Storm Prediction Center also talking about maybe issuing a watch here sometime soon for the central part of the state. Something we'll watch for. I don't think severe storms will be widespread, but there could be an isolated severe storm uh, that may be capable of producing some uh, gusty winds. So tonight we'll actually get rid of all those storms. We'll go partly cloudy skies and, you know, not as muggy either. We'll see the dry air coming in uh, back behind the cold front, which may trigger some of those thunderstorms today. Low Tonight, 52 to 56, so pretty mild one, and it stays breezy all the way into tomorrow. In fact, the winds ramp up tomorrow around 10 to 20 miles per hour, partly sunny skies, and a few afternoon showers can't be ruled out. I don't think we'll see any thunderstorms, but uh, some of those daytime showers may pop up. On radar right now, things are quiet. Temperatures rising into the widespread 70s. In fact, some areas starting to get close to the upper 70s, like here in York at 77 degrees. But we're, again, we're starting to see some of these showers and storms firing up in the northern part of the state in advance of that cold front, which is uh, on the approach. And like I said, that Storm Prediction Center uh, discussion talked about issuing a watch for the central part of the state. It may come down, uh, it's about a 50 50 chance of that right now. They may issue that. But overall, the chance for severe weather uh, will be right along this front as we head into the afternoon. Again, an isolated chance, not very good conditions, but still there. We'll have to watch it with the heat and the humidity rising in from the south and the west. Right now, these are the uh, storm outlook from the Storm Prediction Center, basically keeping the most uh, best chance for severe weather in the eastern part of. The state and clipping our eastern counties here. You see the yellows area. So we will watch that. The dew points are up. So the humidity is up. Anytime we talk about dew points into the 60s, it starts to feel kind of muggy. And with the sunshine and that front moving through, that may act as some fuel for those storms. So, yeah, the baseball game later today in Lancaster, the Barnstormers at home. First pitch at 7 o'clock. There may be a couple of storms around, but I think by the time the game is ending, we'll pretty much be ending the chance for some of those storms as well. On Predictor, here's what it looks like into the afternoon. You see uh, that convection. Firing up across our area. We'll have to watch for eh, some frequent downpours and maybe some lightning along with that. And then it clears out of here going into tonight. As into tomorrow morning, we start off with sunshine. And then again, maybe the chance for a couple of showers popping up during the afternoon. It looks like it keeps it mainly in the eastern counties. As we head into your Memorial Day weekend, it looks uh, relatively calm, although I can't rule out a spotty shower or two as we head into Saturday afternoon. The rest of Memorial Day weekend, though, is looking pretty good. Here's the seven day forecast for you. We'll see those temperatures rising into the 70s. For the weekend, 82 for Memorial Day itself. Chance of showers there as we go into Tuesday and mild day on Wednesday with partly sunny skies, a high of around 78 degrees. And